Welcome to another daily recap for Wednesday, November 8, 2023. You are looking at a one minute chart of the SPY or spiders, which tracks the S&P 500 index. The four blue horizontal lines represent levels that were identified and calculated before the market opened this morning. And these four levels produce trades in the ES or the E-mini futures today. And I'll explain the dotted horizontal red line in a moment. The first trade of the day was triggered at 9.54 a.m. when the spiders hit the level to the penny. This 438.14 had a five cent buffer factored in, which meant that the position that was on the board tr to trigger a short trade in ES was at 438.09, five cent below this 438.14 level. And as you saw, this candle hit that level to the penny and pulled away, producing a pretty quick and nice clean base hit. And the other three levels produced similar trades, each on the long side as the spiders came into them and bounced away. Even this last level at 435.69 that came into play at 4, sorry, at 12.02 p.m. produced a base hit, although it might not be immediately apparent. That's why this dotted red line is here. This abrupt falling away from the entry point looks like this trade may have been stopped out, but per the rules of the strategy that I use, no signal was produced down here that would have told me to stop out the trade. What I was looking for was certain closes at certain times that would have been that would have indicated that the trade was a fumble and further steps need to be taken below this this uh, red line here. And by, by the way, not to get too deep into the woods, but there was another level that was calculated this morning that was about 10 cents below the low of day here that was never hit. Because it was there, even if there had been a signal to call this trade a fumble, there would have been no reversal. And the reason is because this other cal calculated level that was down here existed, it provided an additional reason that the spiders were near a rebound area. In any case, the trade here at 435.69 did work as planned, provided the base hit when the spiders whipped back up during this 1223 candle, and all told there were four base hits that were pulled out of the market today, all before lunchtime. Now we'll look at how all this back and forth translated into money today. As you can see, all levels that were hit today performed as designed. Four base hits totaled 16 points, 16 ES points, and a pretty good day, even if you were trading just uh, two contracts. Keep piling up the base hits and growing your account, and that's the name of the game. Hope you found this information interesting and helpful. Have a great day.